What's up guys, welcome to the first video of 2020. It's gonna be an important video and it's something that's probably gonna affect the majority of the people watching this video. So magnesium deficiency is a huge, huge problem and most of the population has a magnesium deficiency. Um, you're probably not even aware that you have a magnesium deficiency, but there are a few signs and symptoms to look out for. And I'm gonna show you a list of things that uh, could occur when you have magnesium deficiency. So let's get into it. So the first symptom of magnesium deficiency is muscle twitching and cramping. So if you get a lot of cramps, a lot of weird twitches in the muscles, more than likely it's a sign of magnesium deficiency. Number two is insomnia, struggling to sleep. Magnesium helps you calm down, it helps the nerves and it helps you sleep a whole lot better. Number three is anxiety. So this is one thing that I struggle with severely and I was having five panic attacks a day and just a general feeling of anxiety. So if you're feeling very anxious all the time, you're feeling on edge, you feel shaky inside, that could be a biggest warning sign of magnesium deficiency. So since taking magnesium, I haven't had any panic attacks. So I can feel that if I don't take magnesium for an extended period of time, I feel a lot more anxious. I start feeling a little bit shaky and everything that generally I can deal with easily starts becoming like a mountain that I need to climb. When you take magnesium, it calms the mind, it calms your body and your nervous system needs magnesium to function properly. The cells need magnesium to function properly. So that's a huge, huge thing for me. Taking, um, taking magnesium really helped with my anxiety and just made me a lot calmer. Felt a lot calmer taking magnesium. So definitely take it if you have anxiety, if you have depression, it can help with your mood. It just makes you feel calm inside and relaxes you. Number four is weak bones. So a lot of people take calcium as a supplement, drink lots of milk, and they think they've got strong bones. But the truth is, if you don't take magnesium, the calcium is not gonna absorb into your body as efficiently. So the calcium needs magnesium to absorb into the bones to give you strong bones. So taking magnesium can give you a much better bone health. Number five is energy. So if you're feeling tired all the time, then you definitely need to start taking magnesium. Magnesium helps give you the energy, it works on the central nervous system, and it makes you feel a lot more energized. If you're feeling lethargic the whole time, some people even go to the doctors thinking that they've got a thyroid problem because they're so tired all the time. And then more than likely it turns out they take magnesium, they have energy, they feel a lot better. So taking magnesium just helps you with general health. Not only does it help boost your energy, it helps boost your immune system, it keeps your cells functioning properly. So if you're not getting enough magnesium in your diet, you're not going to have magnesium for all these functions that your body needs. The body uses magnesium for over 300 biochemical processes in the body. So if you're not getting enough, you're definitely going to be deficient because it's an element, your body doesn't produce it, you have to get it through your food. So definitely take magnesium supplement. There's a whole bunch of other benefits of magnesium, but these are the most important ones that are really, really going to help you and uh, make you feel a lot better, energized, stronger bones, and most importantly, specifically for me, is a regular heartbeat because it helps with the heartbeat, keeps the heart beating at a constant pace and you're not having those anxiety attacks and not feeling freaked out the whole time. So if you're struggling with injuries or muscle cramps or any of these symptoms, definitely, definitely add magnesium to your diet and you'll feel a world of difference.